U novembru 2011. godine razgovarali smo sa Kenom Skulandom, profesorom ekonomije i političkih nauka na Havajskom pacifičkom univerzitetu u Honolulu u Havajima. Profesor Skuland je ekonomista, akademik, autor i politički komentator. On je veoma poznat u libertarijanskim krugovima širom svijeta kao autor svjetske i poznate knjige Avanture Jonathana Galibla, kao i pratećeg uvoda u libertarijanske principe pod nazivom Filozofija slobode. Tokom godina profesor Skuland je pisao o mnogim temama koje se tiču ekonomije, obrazovanja i javne politike uopšte, a njegov rad se pojavio u mnogim publikacijama širom svijeta. On je član libertarijanske stranke u Havajima, na čijoj platformi se naticao kao kandidat za američki senat 1988. i 1990. godine. 2008. godine pružio je podršku Ron Paulu u kandidaturi za predsjednika. Profesor Skulan trenutno vrši dužnost predsjednika Međunarodnog libertarijanskog udruženja pod nazivom International Society for Individual Liberty. I konačno Ken i njegova supruga Lee Zhao Skulan su domaćini mjesečnih libertarijanskih foruma pod nazivom The Foolish Think Salon, gdje se održavaju predavanje, političke diskusije i širi mreža libertarijanskih kontakata. Profesor Skulan, thank you for having us. Thank you very much for being here on this. I'm delighted to meet you and see you again after so many years. Let's start with the prelude to the to the Jonathan Galibo book, mm -hmm. and of course that is the philosophy of liberty. Yes, can you tell right. us something about that? Yes, yeah, so originally when I wrote this book, it was the uh, with the intention of, of reaching out with free market ideas to an unfriendly audience here in Hawaii, actually over the business uh, radio station here, mm -hmm. and it was um, it gathered popularity because it was not dry normal economic commentary. Mm -hmm. And uh, Sam Sloan of Small Business Hawaii decided to um, put it into a book and use it in the schools. Well, um, very early on, I had a friend that I met in St. Petersburg, Russia, right after the fall of the Iron Curtain and the opening up of the uh, of uh, the Soviet, former Soviet Union at the time. Uh, and uh, we got to be talking about this stuff. He really liked the ideas, and he wanted to publish a book in. Uh, Russia was the first free market book mm -hmm. published in Russia, as far as I know. And uh, he said, you know, we, we have some difficulties understanding certain things in Russia. We're br brand new to this stuff of markets. Could you tell us what property is and what taxes are, you know? So I thought, okay, I'll dry, write up a, a little introduction to this story and, and explain those things. And then it occurred to me, well, this is useful in all the uh, editions, and it's... Uh, uh, something that I now put in the epilogue of all the editions mm -hmm. of the book. And one friend of mine, Carrie Pearson, up in Canada, liked it so much that he decided to make this uh, Philosophy of Liberty uh, animation out of it, which is now in 40 languages on our website, JonathanGullible.com. And uh, so basically it, it starts off with the principle that you own your life. Uh, and the Philosophy of Liberty is based on a principle of self-ownership. And that uh, from that, you can have all of your <coughs> other rights. And likewise, officials don't have any rights that you don't have yourself. In other words, you can't say, well, I don't have a right to steal from another person, but I have the right to ask a, somebody else to do it for me. No, it's still the same. Uh, officials have no more rights than in the, any individual, and uh, they rule by the consent of the governed. Uh, so if we ask them to do something, we can't ask them to do something that we don't have a right to do in the first place. Mm -hmm. So that's the basic uh, idea behind uh, this uh, philosophy of self-ownership. You own your life, your liberty, and the product of your life and liberty. So does everyone else. And you have to treat them in a voluntary mutual exchange or um, honorable way in, in that manner. But the, 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 the use or, or the initiation of force against other people is something that you don't have a right to do. And right. if you don't have a right to do, you can't ask government to do it for you. And, and the philosophy of liberty is so great because it's so short and, and straight to the point. Yeah. And I am really pleased to report to you that we in our Campaign for Freedom and Prosperity in Bosnia and Herzegovina website, we use it as the attention getter Fantastic. to get people attracted to, to the message of liberty. It's like the first thing they see on the homepage is this philosophy of liberty. So right. when they watch that and they say, wow, look at this stuff, it's so interesting. But yet it's so simple, it's like common sense. How come I never I never heard this before? And they're like, oh, okay, I should dig some more. Yeah. So that's what yeah. they do. Oh, that's, that's great. I'm really, really pleased to see that.
Have you yeah, gotten yeah. any other? Uh, well, similar, yes, uh, uh, it's it's been downloaded from our website. We have it available as a download in in uh, up to thirty, well, forty languages now, and people around the world have been using it. Just recently, it was made a, a, available in Arabic, and we had uh, people. Um, using it a lot in Saudi Arabia, mm -hmm. in Tunisia, in Morocco, uh, throughout the Middle East. So we, we, we like to think that it's helping support the cause of liberty and people thinking in a fresh new way. And of course you could imagine how people with power, people in power, um, don't like this message. They like to, and, and throughout history, people with authority have always wanted to let the general population feel that they, uh, the rulers have some superior claim on, on on rights than right. anyone else. They want to keep things to look them. very complicated so that you know people would kind of keep out of these important decisions that really govern their lives, yeah. whereas it's really simple. And it's something that pervades uh, the government's education system usually, uh, telling people, well, you know, you, you have to obey the, uh, the authority figures, uh, be, be content, uh, will uh, the idea of rights is just a privilege that's given to you from government. And this challenges that whole thing. It basically says that, no, your rights begin with you, and, um, and they're not given to you by authorities. Authorities, if they, have, if they have any function at all, is to protect rights. But most of the time, they're not protecting rights. They are violating rights. So you have to make that clear distinction between the initiation of force and uh, the protection against uh, the initiation of force. Right. And uh, what's next for the philosophy of liberty? I hear there's an uh, audio version in the... Yeah, <clears throat> brand new uh, edition that came in from Japan, from um, uh, Hiroshi Yoshida. Um, uh, he's uh, produced a, a version that is, um, has an audio uh, narration with the philosophy of liberty. So it's not just the words mm -hmm. on a screen with music in the background now. It has uh, the beautiful narration as well. Wonderful. Well, we would really like to give you a hand with that for translating it into Slavic languages. Terrific, yeah. I think it'll make it uh, uh, much more appealing to a broader audience. And one day we'll even do it into a, a movie or a film. Oh, that'll, you know, be, that'll, wonderful. that'll be a, a nice way to reach out to right. especially younger audiences. You know. Thank you. By the way, uh, this is the uh, Philosophy of Liberty calendar, too. Oh, <laughs> oh nice. Uh, we're already in November. Uh, Actually, let's kind of go through it because this will be yeah, good okay. for, for some cut in. <laughs> so, philosophy of liberty here. We have a, who, who did this? Uh, Hugo van Rijden. Uh, he lives in uh, Bali and he has a company in, in Nepal that makes this out of rice paper. Oh, okay. I see. It's a special these, uh, paper. Yeah. Nice. It's, it's very nice. And uh, yeah, it's all the all the all the little scenes from the right. philosophy of liberty. That's right. And here's the end. And then December. Oh, okay. That's right. That's really nice. Just for this year. Uh, and actually, the uh, uh, the front of it is the oh, uh, it's philosophy the text of liberty. Yeah. Philosophy right. of liberty. That's right. wonderful. Nice. So is this uh, for making and money? And that's the guy. Well, not really. I think he, he just, every year, he picks a theme and uh, he sends it mm -hmm. to his friends oh, and all that sort okay. of thing, so. Okay. Yeah. Uh, this is beautiful. Thanks. Thanks for sharing that. Okay, yeah. Thank you.